expect Johannes from everyone here. last competition of the year. Especially this man. Third and fourth shooting, completely different stories. Can you tell your side of that? Oh yeah, it was just too exciting. Uh, it was big fight, the final fight with Martin today for the, today's victory, but also the World Cup total score. He was quite fast on the skis today and pushed me quite hard on the shooting range. Uh, I fell off uh, on the, my first uh, standing position and suddenly everything was in his hands. Uh, but I don't know how I could find the five minute targets in the last shooting, but it was crucial and finished in uh, place number four. I knew I had to be at least number four today if he was winning and in the last loop I saw, okay, Marta, he win today, I need to be fourth. <laughs> Crushing the finish line in fourth place, winning World Cup by two points, it's way beyond uh, what uh, I could uh, handle for the pressure and everything, so I think it was a great fight to the end. Martin said one of the reasons he stops is because he knows that new champions are coming and you're one of them. How does that make you feel? I, I, it's so amazing to hear such nice words from uh, this biathlon legend. Uh, Marta make push everyone here at start today to be better biathletes. He, uh, he pushed myself to, to be uh, better not only in skiing but uh, the whole biathlon person. And he has made a lot of the sp uh, to the sport. And, we have to just say uh, a big thanks for everything he has teached us. And uh, for us Norwegians, we had great fights with Martin Forkald since Ola Einar, Tarja and Emil, and now me the last year. So I think both us in the team and uh, the Norwegian uh, viewers will miss Martin uh, now when he finally quits. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Thanks.